Hello class, a very warm welcome to this geography session and today we are going to start chapter 11 of our geography, the tropical and subtropical regions. In this chapter you will study about the tropical and subtropical regions, location, Amazon basin, climate, vegetation, wildlife, minerals, human activities, transport and cities, the Ganga, Brahmaputra Basin, Drainage, Climate, Natural Vegetation, Transport and Cities. The Tropical and the Subtropical Regions Location The tropical region is located between the Tropic of Cancer in the north and the Tropic of Capricorn in the south. The equatorial region is limited up to the 10 degree north and 10 degree south of the equator and the subtropical region extends up to the about 35 degree in both hemispheres. Amazon Basin the Amazon River, about 6,500 km long, is the second longest river in the world after the Nile River in Africa. But it discharges the largest amount of water. The source of the Amazon River is in the Andes Mountain in Peru. It flows into Atlantic Ocean. The Amazon Basin is the largest river basin in the world. The Amazon Basin is drained by the Amazon River and its numerous tributaries. The Amazon River Basin includes a large part of Brazil, Bolivia, Peru, Ecuador, Colombia and a small part of Venezuela. The equator passes through this bank. A major part of this basin is towards the south of equator. This image is showing the tribals in the Amazon Basin. This is the Amazon Basin in South America. Climate The Amazon Basin experiences a uniformly high temperature almost throughout the year. And the average annual temperature is about 27 degrees Celsius. The rainfall is heavy and well distributed almost throughout the year. The general climatic conditions are hot and humid and there is no dry season. Vegetation. The high temperature and heavy rainfall give rise to dense luxuriant vegetation in the Amazon Basin. The tropical rainforests of the Amazon Basin are one of the rare areas where virgin forests still exist. This image is showing Amazon rainforest. These evergreen rainforests are the largest of their kind in the world and are called selva. The trees are tall with hardwood and broad leaves that form a canopy at the top. Mosses and ferns grow on the ground. The carnauba palm tree found here yields was which is used for making shoe polish, varnish and candles. The bark of the chinkona tree is used for making quinine which cures malaria. The juice of the chickle tree is used to make chewing gum. The forest also yield a host of other products like rubber, nuts, gums, raisins and fibers. Wildlife A variety of monkeys and sloths are found in the trees. Pumas and jaguars are animals of prey. Tapins and antiators and armadillos are found on the ground. Reptiles like crocodiles, alligators, turtles, iguanas and different types of snakes including anaconda, the largest snake in the world, around 10 meter long are found in the swamps. Armadillos The rivers have a rich variety of fish including the fierce flesh eating piranha, colorful birds like tokens, hummingbirds, different types of parrots and variety of insects are also found in the Amazon basin. These rainforests are also called the cradle of biodiversity. Minerals. Besides the diversity of plants and wildlife, this region is also rich in many types of minerals, mineral oil, rich copper, tin and bauxite are the main minerals found in the different parts of the Amazon Basin. Human Activities. The Amazon Basin has extremely sparse population. This is so because of the oppressive climate, dense forest, lack of transport facilities and frequent outbreak of diseases like malaria and yellow fever. The core forest areas are inhabited by tribal people. They lead a very primitive lifestyle and obtain their food by gathering, hunting and fishing. They live in small huts made of branches and leaves. These huts are built on raised platforms to avoid the flood waters. The more advanced natives live in small villages. They make their huts with wood, clay and leaves and build them on stilts. They grow tuber crops like yam and and cassive and vegetables on cleared patches of land. Shifting agriculture is a form of agriculture quite common in the forest of Amazon Basin. It is also known as slash and burn agriculture. First, an area within the forest is cleared by felling the trees, then they are burned and crops are planted among the stumps. 
no care is taken of the plants until the harvest main crops grown are cassava yam maize banana and vegetables after 2 or 3 years the soil loses its fertility and then the people abandon the place and look for elsewhere for cultivation this type of agriculture is harmful for the forest environmentalists are trying to stop it in some parts of the amazon basin rubber plantations have been developed where rubber is grown on a commercial scale coffee cocoa and nuts are also grown commercially in some places minerals like iron ore gold tin copper manganese and bauxite are found in the region and has led to the mining activities in some places transport and cities the dense forest and swampy grounds are great hindrances in building roads and railway networks in the amazon basin in the interiors waterways are the only mode of transport the trans amazonian highway is the only major highway in the region it links the atlantic port of recife to peru running through some big towns along the way there are very few big cities in the amazon basin manaus in brazil is a major rubber collecting center in the upper part it is a riverine part that can be reached by large ocean going ship it also has an international airport belem is situated near the mouth of the amazon in brazil it is the chief port of region iquitos in peru is another port in the amazon the amazon rainforest are the lungs of our planet destructions of these forest through our activities can have disastrous consequences in the future the ganga brahmaputra basin the ganga brahmaputra basin is one of the largest basins in the world starting from punjab in the west to assam in the east this lies completely in the subtropical region this basin also lies in bangladesh the ganga brahmaputra basin is situated between 22 degree north and 30 degree north latitudes it is bounded by the himalayan mountains in the north and the peninsular plateau in the south in the east it stretches up to the brahmaputra river in the upper assam and in the west it merges with the indus plain the length of this plain is about 2500 km and its width varies from 100 to 400 km this map is showing the ganga brahmaputra basin in india drainage system The basin is drained by the rivers Ganga, Brahmaputra and their tributaries. Ghagra, Son, Jamuna, Gandak and Kosi are the tributaries of river Ganga, while Lohit, Subansiri and Dehang are the tributaries of river Brahmaputra. Climate: The Ganga Brahmaputra basin experiences monsoonal type of climate. It has hot summers and cold winters. It gets rainfall from mid June to mid September. Soil: The plain has thick cover of alluvium. It has very fertile alluvial soil, natural vegetation and wildlife. In the early times this region was densely forested and the habitat of many wild animals. The forest cover of the Ganga Brahmaputra basin has to be cleared off to meet the demands of agriculture and settlements. Only the lower slopes of the hills are covered with tropical deciduous trees, teak, sal and bamboo are some of the valuable species found here langur leopards tigers deer elephants monkeys etc are the main animals of this basin the sundarbans are famous for bengal tiger as well as crocodile and alligators while in assam one horned rhinoceros is found the deltaic and coastal region are rich in variety of aquatic animals and fish the most popular variety of fish found here are the rohu katla and hilsa kaziranga manas assam sariska rajasthan anbasa uttarakhand are the main wildlife sanctuaries of this region human activities agriculture is the main occupation of the people of the ganga and the brahmaputra basin the fertile alluvial soil ample water from the two river systems and moderate climate make it possible for farmers here to grow a variety of food and cash crops the land holdings are generally small The primitive methods of agriculture used earlier have now given new way to modern farming techniques. Wheat, cotton and sugarcane are the chief crops on the western side of the Ganga plain. While on the eastern side rice, jute and sugarcane are important. In Brahmaputra plain rice, jute and tea are the main crops. 
Pal says oil seeds, vegetables and fruits are also grown throughout the region along the hill slopes in Assam and West Bengal. Tea is widely grown on plantations. In some parts of Bihar and Assam, silkworms are reared on mulberry leaves. In the hilly areas, the slopes are terraced and rice is widely grown. The Brahmaputra River originates from the Mansarovar Lake in Tibet, China and that it is and that it is called Sangpo in Arunachal Pradesh. It is known as Dihang River. River Ganga and Brahmaputra together form Sundarbans Delta and the combined river is called Padma in Bangladesh. A number of agro-based industries have developed in the Ganga Brahmaputra Basin. Cotton, silk and jute, textiles, sugar and food processing industries are important in the Ganga Plain. The Brahmaputra Plain is known for its tea industry. Being rich in petroleum deposits, it also has a number of oil refineries and petrochemical factories. Small scale and cottage industries have developed in rural areas. The important handicrafts of this region include cane work and metal work. Transport and cities. The Ganga Brahmaputra Basin has a good network of roads and railways. It is a flat plain, river Ganga and Brahmaputra and there several tributaries serve as inland waterways. Too much silting however affects their navigability, especially in the Delta region. From the ancient Vedic times, the Ganga Brahmaputra Basin has been a seat of civilization. Fertile soil, adequate supply of water, favorable climate and transport facilities have attracted people to settle down here. It is most populated part of our country. The region is dotted with many important towns and cities, ranging from administrative capitals like New Delhi, Lucknow, Patna, Kolkata and Dispur to industrial cities like Kanpur and religious centers like Haridwar and Varanasi. Summing up this chapter, Maloka, the apartment type house of tribals with steep sloping roofs in the Amazon Basin. Sundari, the main species of the tree which lends its name to the mangrove forest of Sundarbans. Conditions of agriculture are very suitable and variety of food and cash crops are grown. Conditions of agriculture are very suitable and a variety of food and cash crops were, are grown. The Ganga and Brahmaputra rivers together form the largest delta in the world. Dense evergreen rainforest called Selva are found in the Amazon Basin rich in different species of wildlife. River Ganga, Brahmaputra and their tributaries which meander through the plains have left behind a number of oxbow lakes. Thank you class. Let's meet in the next class.